Hey everyone, thought it was time to post a latest video on my latest build that I've been planning for this winter. I've got a couple of these to build actually for the backyard next spring for moving material. My uh, first conveyor build. This one is just under four feet long. It's a tire tube is the belt. It's about three and three quarter. The uh, drums on the ends are inch and a quarter wood dowels, as you can see. Got these turnbuckles and adjusters for tension. Just took me a minute or two to get the right alignment. I didn't have to worry about crowning the drum to keep things straight. This drum actually is full floating. and It was just a matter of getting the alignment just right to keep the belt tracking correctly. Still in the early stages here. Uh, got ways to go yet. I want to install these right here. This will be the for giving the belt some curve. Just a second. Yeah, so that'll sit under the belt like so. Once I get the width proper, might have to go with a little bit bigger wooden bead to give it the curve. But, the main reason for the video is, like I say, I've got it running now. Um, just temporarily with the drill. I'm using miter gears. I'll end up having a little electric motor, gear motor. I've got it actually, it's over here. Just a second. Here it is here. So this is more proof of operation right now, but once it is up and running, I'll have that mounted right like that on the side. But anyways, without further ado, the first run. Ah. And as you can see, it runs pretty straight. And yes, that's this is the inner circumference of the tube. The valve stem was there, but I'll be filling in that hole, and should be good to go from there. I can see it uh, not being an issue. There, I'm going to reverse it. So yeah, coming along nicely. The next one is going to be over five feet long. The outer circumference of that tube is a fair size rubber belt, so it's going to give me lots of reach. And pretty cheap and easy to do so far. Hope you like it. And thanks for watching.